Good morning. It is day three of our juice challenge. Me and my mum are following Jason Val's seven pounds in seven days with a slight meals twist as we've been doing things slightly differently as what Jason would suggest. But as I say, today is day three and I'm very excited because my favourite juice makes its first appearance on the diet and that is the passion for Juice Master. So we'll be having that at 2pm. But before then, of course, we're going to have some breakfast. We're going to have the lemon ginger zinger. Then after that at 11, we'll have the super juice, which we may Made yesterday and the day before that day one and two are quite similar we had the turbo express as well so if you want to see how to make them two juices I'll put a link in the description box below and you can go back and watch them but I suppose I better go up get out of bed and make this a lemon ginger zinger so let's make the lemon ginger zinger so this is quite easy all we need is the juicer we're not going to be using the blender for this one and we have four ingredients that is two apples lemon, ginger and two carrots. Just to let you know with the lemon, you can leave the rind on. Uh, we've decided to cut the rind off because with the rind on it means it's really zesty and with the ginger as well it might be a bit overpowering for us personally because um, we're not majorly keen on spice and kick and stuff. So we just decided to cut the rind off but you can leave it on if you want. Okay, so before you juice, there's a certain order that it has to go in. So you first you put an apple in then you put the lemon in, put the ginger in, and then you sandwich it on top of the other apple. We juice this, and then we add the carrots. So that's what I'm gonna do. started to melt <laughs> but there's some ice in there just to make it nice and cool so I am a bit dubious about this one I'm not gonna lie because not majorly keen on ginger or lemon uh, just not flavors that I choose to eat apart from gingerbread I like gingerbread but we won't be eating any of that this week so let's see how it tastes this is day three a breakfast lemon ginger zinger I think we, we did the amount of lemon and ginger right. I think if you do too much of either, it can have a really bad kick. So the last time we did it, it got to the back of my throat and I didn't enjoy it. But I think we put the measurements right with this one. So happy day three. So this morning we had a lemon gin ginger zinger for breakfast and then at 11 o'clock we had a super juice. But before any of that, while we were still in our dressing gowns, we had the guacamole song in our head. And we were in the kitchen dancing to the guacamole song. So we thought we'd treat you guys to the guacamole dance now. So we had our super juice at 11 o'clock and now it's 2 p.m. and time for my favourite juice out of the whole programme and that is the Passion for Juice Master. Again, a really simple recipe but it does use the juicer and the blender this time so let's get on with it because I'm really excited to have this juice. Um, so firstly to juice it, you need to turn it on. Uh, and we're going to literally just put apples in on fast speed and then we're going to put pineapples in on slow speed. So here we go. That's fast speed, turn it down to the slow speed. You can go to the pineapple. Easy as that, there's the juice done. Now we're going to take it to the blender. Okay, so now that we're over at the blender, in our blender jug we have put some fat-free yoghurt. We're going to add a bit of banana and we're also going to put some 
spirulina in it. We used this yesterday on day two and we're using it again today. I think we use this on the Turbo Express. So if you want to find out how to do Turbo Express, then check out day two and you'll be able to see that. So we just want a leveled teaspoon of it. We don't want too much. That much. Fine. Pop it in. And then we add the juice, making sure we go up to the maximum line and no further. This is the apple and pineapple juice that we put together. And it goes under the maximum line, so that's all good. Okay, and then we pop the lid on and we give it a little bit of a shake. And then we're going to put it in for five seconds and see if the powder's all mixed in. is a lovely colour. I might do it a little bit more because there's still a bit of yoghurt at the bottom so I'm just going to bust it again. There we are, looks all mixed in. I'm so excited about this one. I'm hungry and I know I'm going to love it. I'd be really disappointed if, if it tastes not how I expect it, but I'm sure it'll be Because there's banana in it, normally we have avocado which makes it more filling, but this has got banana and yoghurt in it so this should fill you up for a long time. So this is passion for Juice Master. Oh, it's just as good as I expected. Excuse me. Just sat down to enjoy my dinner. This is a Turbo Express. We made this on day one, so if you want to check out how to make it, do watch that video for day one of the juice challenge. But I'm drinking this now at five o'clock, and then we have another one at eight o'clock. But that does conclude today's video, day three of our seven pound, seven day juice challenge. Tomorrow is going to be slightly different to what we've been doing. We're going to be having the juices in the morning, but then I'm heading on out, so we shall see what happens with the juice diet. But thank you very much for watching. There'll be another video for you tomorrow. So until then, goodbye. So let's try it. It was a lovely colour, nice orange colour. It's a carrot coming out. So this is breakfast on day three. Oh, that kick of ginger, you can feel it in your throat. <laughs> oh, I'm going to have to drink this quickly, I think. Happy day three. <laughs> then we pop the lid on. I always struggle with this lid, I don't know why. I'm sure when you do it at home, you'll put it on straight away and won't have any problems like this. Okay, so after our breakfast, we had, no, wait, sorry, sorry.